out games, what were you guys able to do well enough to kind of keep them at bay throughout the night? Uh, just get stops, uh, keep them off the glass. First half, they got a lot of offensive rebounds, and uh, you know, second half, we uh, made a change and just try to keep them off the glass and uh, get out in transition. I think they only shot 35 shots in the paint, only 12 three pointers. Did you notice something better about kind of the way that you guys defended pick and roll and, and on the perimeter as well? Uh, just communicating better. Um, it's always key when you can communicate and call things out and um, you know, see them earlier before they happen. So uh, I think that's just what happened. We were just communicating really well and uh, got some stops. How would you feel about starting? Um, <laughs> who should I answer? <laughs> um, it was cool. Um, it's no biggie. You know, it's obviously cool to start, but uh, just out there just like every other, every other teammate is doing what I can to help the team win. You know, fortunately, Serge was down tonight, and so I had to step up. How aggressive have you been with Ennis' offensive ability since he's come over? Uh, dude's an ox. Uh, I mean, tonight, I don't know what he had tonight stat-wise, but uh, he's crashing the boards, just finishing everything around the rim, was doing uh, what we needed him to do, and uh, he had a great game tonight. You probably guard him a little bit practice. What makes him so good and so crafty? Uh, he's really skilled. He uh, knows how to finish around the rim, and uh, he's got good footwork. So, uh, you know, once he gets in that deep paint, there's really no stopping him. You got out on the break room until I hit twice when Coach I know that's something you like. You get a little jealous. I told him, I was, like, I was like, hey, man, come on, here, I'm here. But, you know, he just took it and finished it. And, you know, I uh, returned the favor to him uh, a couple a couple possessions later. And, Mitch, were you at all disappointed you didn't go up against Kevin Garnett tonight? Um, you know, I don't, I don't know how to answer that really. I mean, uh, he's one of the greats. Uh, you know, I'd like to get an opportunity to play against him, but to play against the best. But you know, unfortunately, he wasn't playing tonight. So, anyone else? All right, thanks, Mitch. Cool. Thanks.